When upgrading your audio system, it can be challenging for your stock electrical system to keep up with the increased power demands. There are a huge amount of products and upgrades you can use to supplement your existing capacity, but we're going to focus on understanding the difference between the easiest and most common upgrades, capacitors and batteries. Capacitors are basically temporary storage tanks for electricity, designed to charge and discharge at a high speed. A capacitor will not add any more power to the system, but once it's charged up, it will help stabilize the voltage by providing quick bursts during peak demands. Adding a capacitor can reduce occasional headlight dimming or other minor electrical issues, but their primary use is to help provide your amplifier with a consistent voltage for improved performance. Many car audio enthusiasts are opposed to using capacitors to solve electrical problems, as the power they use often cancels out any benefit they provide. Now batteries are an entirely different beast. Adding a secondary battery or upgrading your starting battery will actually increase the power capabilities of your car as a battery holds power more permanently. It is a good practice to upgrade the battery whenever you add an amplifier, but it's absolutely necessary if you begin to experience headlight dimming or other electrical issues. For most cars, about 750 to 1200 watts tends to be the limit of the stock system, but age, condition, climate, and other factors can affect individual performance. If you have minor or infrequent electrical issues, or just want to ensure that your amplifier performs consistently, a capacitor can be a great addition to your sound system. However, batteries are definitely the superior solution for easing the strain on your factory charging system and are available in a wide variety of sizes. So if you're looking to upgrade soon, check out our huge selection of batteries and capacitors at sonicelectronics.com.